What is going on guys welcome back to another video of news application development series in Android Studio. In last video we have got the news successfully from the API. In this video we are going to make UI to display all the news in a recycler view. So let's get started. You can close this. Let's go to activity main.xml first. Click on split. Let's make this constant layout as a linear layout and say hello to this hello world and delete it. So for this linear layout, we will set orientation vertical, we will add more items. So first thing I will add is text view, width will be match parent, height will be wrap content, text will be app name, gravity will be center, margin top will be 5 dp, text size will be 30 sp and font family will be small caps and text color will be my primary. Let's give ID also, so app title. In this way, we have added this app title. Now below this, we will add linear progress indicator so that it will show the progress if we are loading the data. So width will be math parent, height will be wrap content, indeterminate will be true and ID will be progress bar. So in this way here we have got the progress bar as you can see. Now below this we'll add recycler view to display all the news. So recycler view, width will be match parent, height will be wrap content, ID will be news recycler view. So that's it. We have added title. We have added linear progress indicator and the recycler view. Now let's set up the recycler view for that. I need a row. So each item will be the news item. So for that, I will go to layout, new layout resource file, news recycler row, root element will be card view. So widget dot card view, click on OK, click on split. So height of this card view will be wrap content and margin layout margin will be 12 dp. So here you can see there is a card and elevation will be 4 dp. So inside this card view we will add some items. So first thing we will add is linear layout, match parent, wrap content, orientation will be horizontal, padding will be 4 dp and gravity will be center vertical. So inside this linear layout we will add one image view first to show the image. So image view, uh, let's say 100 dp, 100 dp, scale type will be center crop and id will be article image view so in this way here image view will be visible now i want one text view to show the title and one text view to show the source so for that i will use again linear layout to show in vertical linear layout width will be match parent height will be wrap content margin start will be 20 dp orientation will be vertical now inside this linear layout i will add two text view one for title width will be match parent height will be wrap content text size will be 16 sp text color will be black text style will be bold, max lines will be 3 and margin bottom will be 8 dp. So here our text will be visible. You can add tools text to save the text for now. Let's say this is the title. This is the title. So in this way we can see the title over here. Give the ID to it article article title. Now below this we will add another text view. Wrap content wrap content. Text size will be about 12 sp margin bottom will be 8 dp you can add tools text it will be source so here you can see the source give the id article source so in this way our recycler row is also ready here image will come here title will come here source will come let's close this and we have to create an adapter so for recycler view we need adapter let's go to java this package new it will be java class and let's say news recycler adapter. So here first we have to create a view holder class. So for recycler view, we need one view holder class and we need three methods to be implemented. So first thing let's create a view holder class. Let's say class news view holder extends recycler view dot view holder. So you can see, you can hover over here. It will ask to create constructor create it now here let's define all those views so text view title text view and source text view image view image view so we have three things so title text view equals to item view dot find view id r dot id dot article title in the same way it will be source text view article source it will be image view image article image view so that's it our view holder class is ready now in adapter class we have to extend it from recycler view dot adapter we have to give view holder that is news view holder now we can hover here 
it will say to implement the methods click on that we have to implement these three methods click on ok so here we have to implement these three method first thing is get item count how will you get the item count so let's create a constructor here news recycler adapter so here we will get the article list so list of article article list import it here create list of article article list and from this constructor assign this article list to article list so in get item count we can pass article list dot size we are done with this method now let's go on on create view holder method here we have to return the view holder so for that let's create a view first layout inflator dot from parent dot get context dot dot inflate r dot layout dot our layout name is news recycler row we have to pass the view group parent and attach to root will be false return this view so new news view holder we have to pass this view so we have assigned this news recycler row to this view holder now in on bind view holder we have to bind the data with the ui so here first we'll get the article current article equals to article list dot get we have the position so from the list we'll get the current article and in title text view we'll set the title article dot get title in source text view we have to set article dot get source dot get name and for image view we can't do directly we have to add the library let's add the picasso library so go to google and search for picasso library android click on this picasso and from here copy this implementation so copy this go back to the project go to build at gradle and paste it over here so click on sync now we are done so this picasso will help to get the image from the url so what we will do here picasso dot get dot load what we will load we will load from article dot get url to image dot into our image view is holder dot image view so it will get the url and set that image to holder dot image view but there might be some errors so we will handle error also so in error what we will do we will add one icon so go to drawable new vector asset click on clip art and select image hide image this one we can use this or you can use this image not support click on ok so no image icon we can give the name click on next finish so here in error what we will do r dot drawable dot no image icon if there is no image it will show the error also placeholder when it is loading r dot drawable dot no image icon so that's it our adapter class is ready now we'll go to main activity and set up the recycler view so go to main activity so first thing we'll need is recycler view recycler view so here recycler view equals to find view id r dot id dot recycler view that is news recycler view second thing we need is list of article so it will be article list let's create this new article list over here import it and we need adapter news recycler adapter adapter also we have linear progress indicator progress indicator so here progress indicator equals to find view id r dot id dot progress bar now let's create a method for recycler view so here after on create i will set up recycler view so here what we'll do recycler view set layout manager layout manager will be linear layout manager pass the context adapter is called to new news recycler adapter will pass the article list and we have to set the adapter to recycler view adapter so we have to call this setup recycler view from here before getting the news let's set up recycler view now we have to show the linear progress indicator also so for that i will create a method change in progress where we'll pass either it is to show or or to hide so if we have show then progress indicator dot set visibility will be visible else set visibility will be invisible so now when we come to this activity it will start to get the news so first thing we have to do is change in progress should be true it should show the progress bar so after getting the news it should hide it so on success you can remove this now this is different thread we have to run on ui thread so run on ui thread 
give lambda so inside this what we will do we will call change in progress method it will be false it will hide the progress bar now article list will be from response so response dot get articles and we have to update the recycler view so what we have to do is we will go to news recycler adapter and create a method over here that will simply update the recycler view so update data so here what we will do it will clear the article list first whatever it was there and it will add all the article list from the new data what from where we will get the new data here we will pass list of article data so it will add all the data whenever we will get the new news it will clear and it will add the latest data so in main activity what we have to do adapter update data from article list and we have to notify listeners so notify data set changed so that's it when we come to main activity it will set up recycler view it will get the news when we will get the news it will set the new articles to the recycler view let's run it and test it either it is working or not so our linear progress indicator is working and you can see the news over here so linear progress indicator is gone and we got the news image is on image title and the source you can see over here it is looking very good and we are getting the latest news so that's all for this video in next video we'll add the categories we will have some buttons that will be general category technology category sports category or any other category so that if we click on that category it will load the news of that category if you enjoyed this video please hit the like button if you have any doubts and queries please comment below i will reply for you don't forget to hit the subscribe button before going see you in the next video Bye bye